Gravity Man is probably my least favorite boss in the whole set so far. Fighting him is annoying, it's slow, it's agonizing, it's not an exciting fight, and yet it's completely hard because this whole thing is completely dumb. Let's just go to the fight. Okay, first of all, his hitbox is very small. You have to hit him in the head right there, and he's always bobbing up and down, so even if you jump onto the ceiling and fire your buster straight, it, there's no guarantee it'll hit him. It might go right over his head. And not only that, his arms are always rotating, and those can block attacks as well. As you can see, I'm finding it very annoying to actually find his hitbox. Network transmission has really bad hit detection, and it probably took a while for me to talk about this, but the hit detection is very odd. If there's multiple objects that a chip can hit, it will often hit whatever would have taken the least amount of damage. In this case, the arms, which block all damage, are the first priority, even if you wind up a hit with a head. It's very strange to explain. Other than that, Gravity Man has two attacks in total. He has that one attack where he will suck you towards him. And his other attack is this purple ball thing. Yeah. Past have health, he'll fire off two or three of those dark balls, and they can get really difficult to avoid. In fact, I'm pretty sure it's unavoidable entirely. Nah, oh, well, I didn't experiment with it, I just used invis chips. Let's fight him without taking a single hit. This is gonna be fun. Also, you saw me using the dash attack chip just now. That ever useful dash attack chip has a property that I wasn't aware of until I found out that you can bypass spikes with it. Yes, the dash attack chip makes you completely invulnerable while it's out. It's when you stop moving that you actually start to take hits. Anyways, Gravity Man's being rather slow right here. I've hit him with about three mega cannons. Gla I am so glad I was able to farm those up. About seven or eight mega cannons will end any boss fight if you successfully land the hits. And he's almost dead. I could probably use a charge shot and win right here, but no, I pelt him with miniature buster shots just because. Either way, that is Gravity Man beaten with no damage. The chip you get for this is well worth it, I assure you. By which I mean it's not useful at all. 